Hi, I'm Rabbi Sidney Mintz here at Congregation Emmanuel in San Francisco. And one of the most primal sounds of the Jewish people comes from this, the shofar or the ram's horn. The Jewish people are commanded to blow the shofar 100 blasts on Rosh Hashanah, which is supposed to be enough to wake us up in our spirits, in our souls, and in our hearts to open up to the possibility of what the new Jewish year will bring. The obligation or the mitzvah involving the shofar is not to blow the shofar, but instead the blessing is lishmoa kol shofar, to listen to the call of the shofar so everyone can participate in the mitzvah. Today I'm going to blast the shofar four times, give it to you as an example to prepare for Rosh Hashanah, but also if you'd like to learn how to blow the shofar, it's a great way to blast along. First we have tekiah. <laughs> The next blast, Shivarim. The next is Terua. And the last one, we go back to Tekia, but it's the Tekia Gadola, or the very biggest blast. Shana Tovah.